Now let's see what's an exponent. Repeated multiplication of a number by itself is known as an exponent. Let's see an example. Let's say we have 3 raised to power 3. That means 3 into 3 into 3. That means repeated multiplication of a number by itself is known as an exponent. In this case, the exponent is 3. If we have, let's say, 2 raised to power 4. This means 2 into 2 into 2 into 2. That means we have multiplied 2 4 times. In this case, 4 is the exponent. Now, let's say what are we known as, what are called roots. Let's say we have a number 4. The square root that means is depicted by this. The square root of 4 is plus 2 and minus 2. The square root of 9 is plus 3 and minus 3. So here we can see that this the square root of a number can be two numbers that is if we have square root of 4 will be 2 and minus 2 and the square root of 9 will be 3 and minus 3. Now in this case if we don't have any number here that means the, it is the square root that means the power is 2. Here we can say that 2 square is 4 minus 2 square is also 4. In this case 3 square is also 9 and minus 3 square is also 9. Whereas if we have let us say cube root. The cube root of 8 will be 2. We can say that 2 cube is 8. If we have a fourth root of a number, let us say we have 16, fourth root. So the fourth root of 16 is 2 because 2 raised to power 4 is 16. Here we can see another thing. If suppose we have a cube root in which we have a negative number. Let us say minus 2 cube. Minus 2 cube is minus 8. So if we have to find the cube root of minus 8, it will be 2. So if we have an odd root here, we will have only one square. Whereas in cases if we have an even root here, we will have two square roots. That means if we have 16 to the 4th root, the answer will be 2 and minus 2. Whereas if we have 8 to the power cube root, we will have only one answer that is 2. Because if we have minus 2 raised to power 3, the answer will be minus 8. So in this case, wherever we have this value as an odd, the result will be only one value. Whereas if we have this as an even number, in that case we will have two answers.